talk money. What are index funds? Guys, the best example I have is going to be the Dow Jones Industrial Average. Many people use this index fund as the index fund for the overall U.S. market. Whatever is happening in here, they believe is happening in the U.S. markets. Okay, what is this fund? This fund right here has the top 30 biggest, most industrialized U.S. companies, some say. But today we're going to go over what are index funds. Okay, what is an index fund? This article is from Jack Kramer and Nick Martell. Definition. An index fund lets you easily and at a low cost invest in all the stocks that make up an index fund. There are many different index funds. There's the NASDAQ which has stocks like Google, Fitbit, Facebook. There's the FTSEs, F-T-S-E 100, which has Barclays, BP, Rolls-Royce, Burberry. And there's my favorite, the S&P 500, which has stocks like McDonald's, Boeing, Amazon. Some of these index funds do overlap, so you're going to have like McDonald's maybe in the Dow Jones, but also in the S&P. This is for illustration purposes only and does not constitute investment advice. This example is intended to show some of the stocks that are part of the market indices mentioned above. Inclusion in a market index is subject to change. Understanding an index fund. Deciding what stocks to invest in can be challenging since there are many options out there. There's one reason mutual funds and exchange traded funds, ETFs, were created. They take a bunch of money from individual investors, put it in one big pot, and a fund manager uses the money to invest in different areas, strategies, or types. So, a share of an investment fund is like a smoothie, a blend of different investments that an investor can easily buy. Index funds are like smoothies. Whole ingredients are also carefully measured to mimic well-known stock market indices. The results is a low-cost way to help people make diversified investments if you want to invest in stocks but don't know what stocks to invest in, an index fund could be an investment you may want to consider. Example, the S&P 500 is a large cap index fund that includes 500 leading U.S. companies and covers approximately 80% of available market capitalization. If you want to invest in these stocks but don't want to decide which ones, there are many index funds whose shares are built to closely track the movement of the S&P 500. That way, each share of the fund is like a mini S&P 500 stock. Takeaway. An index fund acts like a mime. It tries its very best to replicate the makeup of the stock index, such as S&P 500 and seeks to move just like the stock market index does. There's the mime. Guys, if you're liking this, like, subscribe. Let me know what you think about index funds. Let me know if this is something that you guys are interested in using for your portfolio. There's also information on here of how an index fund works. There's also information on here about popular index funds. 
So that's the end of our video today. But I do want you all to know uh, that you guys, please, please, please stay awesome. And I guess I'll see you all next time. And later.